<laughs> no, no. It's just a trick. <laughs> oh, honey. Hmm. I think it's time to tell you a story. There was a boy who watched the sheep. The silliest boy you ever did see. One sunny day, who knows why? He thought for fun, he'd tell a lie. That wolf away again There was no wolf Not even one It's just a trick I played for fun <laughs> Hey, young man Don't play that trick on me again huh. Okay, I promise The very next day at half past ten The silly boy decided to trick them again Up from the hill he shouted out loud just for fun. Wolf, please come. Hurry, hurry. Run, run, run. And up the hill the farmer came to chase that wolf away again. There was no wolf. Not even one. It's just a trick I played for fun. <laughs> hey, I told you. Don't play that trick in me again. Huh. Okay, I promise. But that same day at the afternoon, a big bad wolf came into view. Into the field, the wolf did creep to scare the boy and steal the sheep. Time the wolf stole every sheep in sight. The little boy was very sad because he knew that he'd been bad. He decided there and then, I'll never ever lie again. The most important thing to do. Always, always tell the truth Tell the truth, tell the truth Let 
that beard? Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. No, no, no. Oh, yeah? Now I'm going to huff and puff. Huff and puff. Huff and puff. Now I'm going to huff and puff and blow your little house down. can't do that. You can't do that. The farmer took the wolf away and the three little pigs were safe. And that was the story of the three little pigs. Three little pigs, three little pigs. And that was the story of the three little pigs. Once upon a time, once upon Of course, the story is Little Red Riding Hood. <gasps> Yay! Little Red Riding Hood went out one day. One day! She was going to Granny's far away. Far away! She followed a path through the deep dark woods to get to Granny's as quick as she could. As quick as she could! <laughs> A big bad wolf came into view. Oh, oh, whoa! He raised his head and said, How do you do? My granny is feeling ill. I'm bringing her cookies to make her well. Oh, I must run. My granny is waiting for me. Goodbye. Goodbye. But the big bad wolf knew a faster way. So he reached Granny's house before Little Red. Poor Little Red! He put the Granny in the closet. Then he put on her clothes and jumped into bed. Little Red Riding Hood arrives to the house. To the house! Dear Granny, I came as quick as I could. Great big ears you have! What great big eyes you have! Granny, what great big teeth you have! The better to eat you with! Oh, oh no! Help! Cried Little Red Riding Hood! Help! Help! And in ran a hunter who was in the woods! In the woods! The hunter grabbed the wolf and he put him in a sack And the big bad wolf, he never came back He never came back <laughs> We're safe now, Granny The little girl said The little girl said And she helped Granny get back in bed Back in bed They ate the cookies happy and that's how this story ends. And that's how this story ends. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. 
Huge teddy bear. Yay! I see you. <laughs> peekaboo, peekaboo, we love to play peekaboo. <laughs> Playroom? Nope. Are you behind the building blocks? Nope. Ah, behind the chair? Yeah. Peekaboo. <laughs> I <laughs> see you. <laughs> peekaboo, peekaboo, we love to play. Where is baby? Where is baby? Are you behind that tree? Nope. Are you on the swings? Nope. Ah, oh, on the slide? Yeah. Peekaboo. <laughs> I see you. Peekaboo. 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 We love to play peekaboo. <laughs> 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 